Hello friends, welcome to my channel. This is Charan. In this video, I will show you how to get selected checkbox values into a text box or a text area with comma separate. For this example, I'm using Notepad++. And in this Notepad++, which contains some HTML code, let's save this file. We'll check the output on the browser, how it looks the designing part. And here is the output of that code. Let's switch back to Notepad++. We'll add the checkbox controls, text area, and jQuery script. After H1, input type checkbox. I'm adding class value. See. Let's copy this. C sharp PHP JavaScript JavaScript horizontal line. I'm adding text area type text id is equals to selected text place holder selected check boxes I'm closing this text area break I'm adding input type text ID is equals to count placeholder number of selected checkboxes now here in this code I have added four text boxes one text area and and one input text box control now between the header I'm adding script type text slash JavaScript Closing the script dollar document dot ready function dollar. I'm adding checkbox class. When I'm adding class, I need to put the dot dot click function. Variable text is equals to dollar. dot checkbox class if the checkbox is checked dot each function text plus is equals to dollar this this dot val method plus comma 
text is equals to text dot substring method so it's two parameters one is zero text dot length minus one it's a property after that dollar I want to display the selected checkbox values in this text area so I'm choosing the text area ID hash val text now the second condition is I want to count the selected checkbox so variable count is equals to dollar is equals to checkbox this is in the single quotes column check dot length property dollar I want to display results in this input text box hash count this is a single quotes dot val let's copy this paste here the column is outside the bracket that's it we have just finished the jquery script but one important point is we have to add the jquery cdn link which is let's save this file now it's time to check the final results on the browser i'm reloading the browser and here we got our controls checkboxes text area and input text box when i select php it displaying the PHP value and as well as the it's counting the selected text box JavaScript C sharp if I unselect any of the selected checkbox see the PHP has been deleted from the text area and as well as the counting also changing that's it if you like this video please leave your valuable comment share this video and please subscribe my channel catch you on my upcoming videos